Hi, I'm Rip Esselstyn, and this is the Engine 2 Diet Prep Week. What I want you to do this week is get your head into the game before you start the 28 days. For example, I bet you have no idea what this is. This is a microplaner, and it's great for zesting citrus. This can be a very, very valuable tool in making the 28 days very tasty and palatable. So what are some of the things I want you to do this week? Firstly, if you don't have the book, buy the book, read the first 120 pages. It is chock full of all kinds of great information that will allow you to embrace this in a much stronger way. Number two, we have the website. It, is a, it will be a wonderful support ally for you uh, over the next 28 days. We have a customized meal planner where you can go through pick out your different meals for the week and that will then generate a customized week by week grocery list for you. We also have a wonderful community forum and we have all the plant strong recipes from the book right here at your disposal. So the next thing I want you to do besides read the book and become intimately acquainted with the website is I want you to go through your kitchen, go through your ice box, go through your cupboards, go through your pantry and let's start removing the foods that aren't Engine 2 approved. Uh, if they're there, you'll be like a moth going to flame and you just, it's, we don't want this to be about willpower, all right? We want to do this intelligently. So what are we going to remove? We're going to remove all animal based products that you have in your kitchen. We're going to be removing all the dairy, the butter, the sour cream, the ice cream, the milk, the cheese. We're going to be removing chicken, red meat, uh, fish, any animal based products, okay? We're also going to be removing um, processed and refined foods. Let's get rid of the cookies, let's get rid of the soda pop, let's even get rid of a lot of the fruit juices that are just really just concentrated calories. And let's also start removing products out of your freezer uh, that have more than 2.5 grams of fat per 100 calories. Um, this may sound daunting, but I'm telling you right now, in its place, we're going to be putting in all kinds of wonderful whole grains, frozen fruits, frozen vegetables, fresh vegetables, frozen vegetables. Um, we're going to be putting in beans, legumes, lentils. You're going to be stockpiling your kitchen with foods that are going to love you back, that are your friend, not foods that are your imaginary friend. The last thing, and maybe the most important, is family and friends. The degree to which you can enlist family and friends to do the 28-day health opportunity with you is the degree to which it will make it easier and will help to guarantee your success. Now, it is by no means absolutely necessary for you to have a fire buddy, engine tube buddy going through the 28 days, but it will make it that much easier. In addition to the things I just talked about, it also can be very, very motivational if you can get some pre-biomarkers done, whether it's blood work, total cholesterol, HDL, LDL, triglycerides, whether it's weight, uh, whether it's if, you're, if you have the potential to be pre-diabetic, get a fasting glucose done. Uh, all, th all these things will be wonderful markers so you can see at the end of the 28 days um, all the tremendous results and how far you've come. Good luck with Prep Week. Your journey to health starts now. I look forward to seeing you next week at the start of week one.